The road to representing Kenya at a world championship in athletics isn't easy, with many athletes competing for the few available spaces. So competitive are the trials that many athletes equate them to world championships. On Saturday, 300 athletes were present in a bid to fill the 24 available places to the World Cross Country Championships in Guiyang, China, next month. The men's 12-kilometer race was hotly contested in the first few laps before Geoffrey Kipsang, Bedan Karoki and Leonard Barasoton led a breakaway. Karoki's experience showed, however, as he won the race with Kipsang in second and Barsoton in third. Moses Mukono, who was making his senior team debut after sitting his final exams, finished fourth to make the team of six to Guya. Being in school and combining school and uh, athletic is a big, a big thing to do and it's challenging. I knew I can do it because uh, I've been having a full time with these guys and uh, I knew these are big boys I'm going to, to compete with and so I, need, I wanted to train very hard and I did that. I really wanted to make it to the team and I'm happy I have. This year, I've worked on my endurance and it's paid off. I did a lot of hill work training and speed work to help me with my finishing. So I think this time, I won't come home empty-handed. The women's race was won by former junior star Faith Chemingatich, who will be making her senior world championships debut. Faith will be among seven female athletes representing Kenya, including defending world champion Emily Chebet. Chebet got a wild card after finishing 14th. Cross country will motivate me to do well in the track season, especially since this is a world championship here on the track. Twelve athletes were also named in the junior category, six in each division. Despite the huge turnout, cross country running in Kenya seems to be losing its competitive nature. It starts to go down and less money involved in the cross country in Europe. And now that it's every two years, of course, they lose a bit of interest, in, but I think will be a big interesting in China this year. The morale of athletics is now slowly going down. I don't know which I think uh, we need to sit down as the country or as the federation to see what is happening because I remember when you are running, those times you can see people, even when they are running, you can see that teamwork. But now somebody, you see somebody, this year, next year you don't see. 25 athletes were selected for the match competition where Kenya will be defending three individual and two team titles. Changing the World Cross Country Championships from an annual to a biennial event made the competition lose some of its shine. But the team selected to represent Kenya will still be expected to maintain the stranglehold the country has on the competition. Celestine Karone, CCTV in Nairobi.